All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to some more of the Golf Club 2019. Welcome back to week 37 of the Fantasy Course of the Week. It's been set up by that man right there. You see with the lion picture, Fairhurst 1970. I was actually really busy today, so he set up the society event, and we're good to go. This is last week's one. Uh, Mr. Palatos, or Mr. Palotes, I don't know how to say that, won it. Uh, at 12 under so that's the lowest winning score we've had by far it was a tough course there was definitely some holes where things could go badly wrong and my norwegian brethren there came uh second slew bastion so fair play to him we came in a tie for 94th we didn't have a good week particularly so i'm hoping that things are better and there he is on the leaderboard as well fairhurst 1970 at nine under in a tie for fourth we're gonna try be a little bit higher up this time and um, so let's advance uh, I don't actually know the name of the course of this week. Let's have a look now. We're going to find out together for the very first time. Let's see. Play event. Uh, oh, okay. I don't know how to say that. We'll just call it the Gorge course. Gorge Euro. Uh, sounds fun to me. I'm ready to do it. Fairhurst, as you can see, is 7 under through 10 holes. He is leading the tournament so far. Impressive stuff from him. Let's see if we can catch him. The golf. So glad you could join us for this event. All right, the wind is pretty low. I'm going to ask uh, Darren to turn it on for Today's the next event, uh, event. turn back on the wind speed just so, so we can see exactly to see uh, the miles the per hour. I just prefer to being to able to know team. exactly, you know, what I'm in for. So I'm going to do that. And 417 yards. Let's just start off with a drive up the middle. Oh, I was hoping the wind would take that back a little bit more. Oh, no. Not a good start. Oh, it's worked out for us. It's worked out just fine for us. I like the way there's a crowd and everything here. Okay. The crowd is here. In this next shot. Spurring me on. You love hole. to see it. Is that new? I don't, I don't remember the crowd being in the last couple of events. Am I tripping? It's definitely going over that way a little bit. The wind isn't too strong, but at the same time, like, it's uphill as well quite a bit. So I'm going to put some D-loft on the pitching wedge. And hopefully this can make it up Here there. Is the pitching wedge? No, that's short. And way I don't short. I don't think this one's gonna pan out. Wow, that's way short. That wasn't even. Oh, I hit it slow yeah, on the backswing, but still, I don't think shot. it affected it's it that much. We should have been a one. lot closer than that. That's pretty embarrassing, to be honest. I'm gonna put max loft on this bad boy, and whip it up into the air, and hopefully that we can make something happen here. Get some spin on that baby. Come on, come on, come on back down there. The crowd goes wild for the bunker shot on the first hole. We shouldn't have been like in that, that situation, but if we can get a par Ours out of it, it won't be the end of the world. world. All right, and putting is one thing that we need to improve on massively in this game. I went to the range actually a little bit before this uh, round. I thought, you know, if I practice a bit, it couldn't do any harm. Uh, Fairhurst leading at eight under through 11 holes. That is impressive stuff. There's another Irishman, Cameron Donahue, two under through five. We'll try and match our fellow Irish fella. All right, let's go. Come on, boys. And now let's see what this I want a good round today. Score. I haven't had a really good round in the golf club in a couple of weeks now. So I'd love a good round here. We got a par five. Let's get uh, at least get a birdie here and start off our tournament. Start it off beautifully so. All right, we should be able to get down there. It's downhill. That is just picture perfect. Oh, that's gonna be too far. And uh, nicely done. Looking needs like to sit. We'll have needs to sit. Needs to sit. here. I think it'll be just fine. I'm hoping. Yeah, it's gonna be just fine. No, it's not. It's absolutely not. Damn it! It's okay, and, uh, but it would have been nice like to have been shot, in the. Uh, actually, ended up. Oh, in the I don't know if it is okay. Actually, you know what? Should be fine. You think I can go at this? Ninety percent. The wind should help, but what if I still get a decent lie if I hit this, but it's going to be too far. No doubt about it. I'm just going to try hit this. Screw it. I'm going to try hit it a little fast if I can. I did hit it. I hit it way too fast is the problem. That actually might be perfect. If it gets a good bounce, bounce forward. Oh, dude, it didn't get a good bounce forward. That's going to come all the way back into the bunker. Wow. Dude, if that had got a bounce forward, it would have been perfect. Would have been at least on the first tier of the green there. That's depressing. Really depressing. That was such a good strike, too. That's unfortunate, man. I'm going to put near full loft on this. Not quite, but... But that many. That many? That doesn't even make sense, but you know what I mean. That's perfect. No, it's not perfect. Don't spin. Don't spin. 
Oh my god. Okay, we shouldn't have put Very that much nice loft on it at all. Yikes. Alright, come on. Let's make the birdie out of it, and we'll forget about what just happened on the last two shots, you know? It'll be fine. How much is this gonna turn? We need to start making some putts. And we're gonna start and making some putts, baby! That's how you do it! Birdie on the second. And, one under for the and day we're to one under through two. Right, I want a good... I'm gonna set the target right now. Six under par I wanna be. It seems like people are scoring quite well on this course so far. Um, so if if we get to six, seven under, that would be decent. I, I'd, I'd appreciate that, you know, it would be decent. Has in store. Let's see. All right, a nice little 189 yard par three. It's a cool course so far. I'm digging it. The Gorge Euro, it's kind of plain-ish, but uh, I like it so far. Let's see if we can make something happen here. Going to put a little bit of D-loft on this bad boy. And hopefully... Oh, I hit it a little fast. But that might actually be okay. It's going to be a little far, but it's a decent golf shot is what I'd call that. Solid golf shot. And it's a birdie chance. Can we go and back to back? Is on with a, uh, Let's find out. Lengthy putt coming Ooh, up. it's makeable for sure. If I can hit this putt solid, it should be in. Did I hit it? No way. Oh, it didn't... Uh, very close. It did turn a little bit. I thought it wasn't going to turn that much. I played it, like, Point just the outside the hole, but it turned a little bit more than I thought it would. All right, we'll have to settle for the par there. Probably should have made the birdie, but it's not the end of the world, all right? It's not the end of the world. Thank you for the continued support every week on these videos, by the way, guys. It really does mean a lot. Like, um, just right, how long I've been goal. playing this game, how long I've been playing golf games. It, it's beautiful to see that... The community around it is still there, still here. I love the sport of golf. I'm playing in real life tomorrow. And I can't wait to, to get out and get around in real life as well. But yeah, just appreciate you guys sticking with me this long. We're nearly at 100,000 subscribers. We wouldn't we wouldn't be at 100,000 subscribers if it wasn't for the game of golf. Like, that, I'm not denying that at all. Like, that's a fact. Because golf helped my channel so much. Especially the Roy McIlroy game. Uh, that really helped me a lot. And then the golf club... The Golf Club and 2 and the Golf Club 2019 all and spurred it on as well. Five yards to the pin. All right. This is a chance now to make something happen. The wind is with us here big time. And we're, we have it. We have a five iron in our hands. Let's get this one up there and close. I'm going to actually play it out to the left a little bit here because of the lie that we have. It's not great. It's kind of shoot. It's going to make it shoot to the right a little bit, but the wind should bring it back then again. I think that's a. Oh, I hit it iron. fast. That might just be okay, though. Get the kick to the right. No, it got the kick to the left. Wow. That's unfortunate. It was actually a half-decent shot, but... just that We're getting a few unlucky kicks early in this round. Unlucky on that approach and, But shot. if we keep playing how we no, are, no. we should start Club making on that one, some I more think. birdies. And I'm going to make one here. Nice little up and down here. That's in. Slow down. Slow down, Betsy. Slow down. My God. It just kept going. It was very fast, I guess. About six feet away. But still. Come on. Don't do this to me. And we make the birdie putt. Our putting's been solid so far. That one on the third on the par three. It was still a solid putt. I just kind of misread it a little bit. But we're hitting the putt solid. All right. Two under through four. Not the end of the world. It's, it's good shooting so far. Decent shooting, we'll call it. We'll try and get into, like, the top five by the end of the round. Oh, shit. Dropped my, the cap of my bottle right there. We're good, though. Everybody stay calm! Okay, stay fucking calm! Oh. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, that's a nice shot right there. It's like the shadow coming down upon us. This is a drivable par four, huh? Ooh, this is risky, though. Do we risk it for the biscuit is the question. Is it uphill? It's slightly uphill. Yeah, I don't want to risk it. I think going beyond it, there's not really a problem. So I might as well hit it over here and have like a bunker shot back or something like that. But yeah, let's just go over. Kind of sliced it. That actually might work out okay because it might be in the fairway instead of the bunker now that we sliced it. <laughs> Maybe flopping distance. I think it'll just be outside flopping range. We'll have to pitch it unless we can get the 42 yard flop on this one. Oh no, it's 30 yard flop. Never mind. We're, we're closer than I thought. Never mind. Okay. Let's do this thing. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down for me. 
Sit down for me, ball. Come on, why did that not sit a little bit more? It's still going, it's still going. Come on, man. Don't do don't do me like this, man. This one's for birdie. Come on, man. Alright, let's make the putt though. Doesn't matter if we make the putt. No! What's up with the graphics, by the way? Very pixely. And yeah, I didn't give that one enough break. That's yeah, that's just a little here. bit underdone there. Alright, we're getting chances. Just need to put away some of those chances a little bit better. Get the it's chip shots a little bit closer. Two spots on the leaderboard. We just need to improve a tiny bit and we'll be good. Fairhurst 9 under through 15. Impressive shooting there, man. Impressive shooting. If I can get anywhere near that, Setting I'd be quite happy. But tee off, wind could be an issue if I can settle for like 6, 7 under without any disasters, that's what I want. I don't want to have like a disaster today. Because that always seems to happen to me. I always do so have some hole where I just completely mess up and ruin the round. And I don't want that. Yeah, it looks I like was going to say this iron. might be it because I thought I hit that very fast for a second, but it's only fast. So it's not the end of the world. Just uh, just a little bit to the left. That would have been really good if it wasn't fast, I think. Would have been really good. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Because it was dead straight. I'm pretty sure the wind uh, the culprit there. It was dead, dead straight. You know what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the nine yard with a little bit of lock. Really? Come on, man. You're joking me with that. Oh my god. Wow. Wasn't even close. Like, that's crazy. And we're about to make our first bogey of the day now. This is a tough hole, to be fair, but I was hoping to avoid any bogeys, if possible. Maybe it's still possible, but we need to hold a big, big putt here. Didn't leave it enough break, did I? No. Damn it. Alright, it's a bogey. Disappointing. A lot of par fives and par threes so far. To Not too many par fours. The only par four really was the the drivable one, and the first hole was a normalish par four, wasn't it? And after I think. That hole one under for the day. Ah, uh, that's disappointing. Okay, tenth. come on, let's get back into it though. A couple eagles or something like that. All right, here's a standard par five, par four rather. Can we go for this? Absolutely no chance. I could probably get over here, but I don't know if it's worth it. You know. Like, I, I don't think it's worth it to just get into the rough here. We might as well play it like a normal, a normal par four. It's just smarter play, really. That's going to be perfect. Should just stay off the rough, I'm hoping. No, never mind. It's going to be in the rough. Don't be in the heavy, though. All right, it's okay. Ain't the end yeah, of the world if it's in the light rough. Could be worse, you know. Maybe I should have gone for it because I'm in the rough anyway. <laughs> maybe, just maybe. I'll hit the 160, but I'm going to put a bit of loft on it. Decent. That's got to be good. Sit down. Sit down, ball. Ooh, it's decent. It needs to sit, though. Come on. All right, it's a chance. Pretty Come sure on. Like well, I'd that. love to get the birdie That's back straight bird. away. Ooh. It's dead straight. Dude, I thought it was going to just miss right. I was like, please, no. Because I hit it straight and it said it was dead straight. And we did it. We did it. Two under. Okay. Are we last on the leaderboard? There's no way. I was just, this just the first page. I guess everyone else has played more holes than me, but still. Two under through seven ain't that bad. Like, I guess all the good people are playing early. And next on the plate is the eighth hole. Ooh, it's a long par four. Okay. I'm down with it. Hmm. Right, what are we going to do here? Do we want to bend it like Beckham, or should we just play it? Yeah, I just, I think we'll just play it like this. Three wood off the tee. Play smart. Oh my god, that was awful. And I'm not quite sure where Jesus this Jesus Christ, that was awful. Very fast, and that's going to be in the heavy rough. I don't even know if we're going to be able to reach the green from here. It seems like it's set up, but oh, it's not a bad lie. It's not an awful lie, but also this is a very... Long hole already, so I don't know if we're going to be able to reach this. Shit, man. I messed that up completely. What have I done there? Like, that was stupid. Stupid. I hit it very fast again. And What's going on there? Could end up in the fairway, though. What is going on there, man? Could end up in the fairway. Is that the fairway, yeah? That was hit out of some very, We need very to get up and down for a pair now. Into some not-so-deep rough. Yeah, you think? I don't think I'm going to reach it with this. 
I'm not going to reach with this like I know I'm not. Oh, this is depressing. I don't know what to do here. I just don't know what to do with myself. Bump, bump. Yeah, I was always going to be long. There's not much I could have done, really, and we're going to have to settle for a bogey unless we can hold a long, long putt. Path. And it's not an easy one, either. God damn it, man! Every Everything was going so well. I just hit two very fast shots in a row out of nowhere. What was that, man? What was that? Come on, turn for me. Turn for me, baby. Not that much. Not that much. Damn it! So close. God damn it. Bogey, birdie, bogey. If we make this one, that just kept going. And this putt is for bogey. Oh my god. Alright. It's a tough course. A like, there's definitely putt. some holes where, like, things can go and wrong. Especially if you hit two very fast shots in a row, which is just not on, really. Alright, we, we need to we need start making some course. birdies, because... Two bogeys, never gonna be able to compete with two bogeys on the card, because people in this game are just too good, you know? People in this game are just too damn good at the video game, so it's impossible to compete if you're making bogeys in a round. Okay, I've just completely lost my touch all of a sudden. Be in the rough, but, uh, could not be. Let's find out. Oh, thanks. Great. Great. This could be in the rough, but it could not be. Thanks, dude. It's actually not be, okay? Good commentating, though, John. We really appreciate that, dude. I'm definitely hitting this. Oh my god, I hate when there's lies like this. It's the worst. I never know like quite how far to go out to the to the left or anything. It's very annoying. Feels like this one's going way right. Yeah. But it might come off that ridge there. Back down to the left a little. Yes, that's perfect. And that should be a birdie again. Bogey birdie, bogey birdie is what we're about and to go here. <laughs> Alright. This one looks about uh now four feet. we're gonna Stop making bogeys, and we're going to start making more birdies. More, more, more. Let's just start making birdie, 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 birdie. Let's go on a streak. It's been a while since I've gone, like, on a big birdie streak. Like, four, or five, six birdies in a row. It's been a while. Okay, and I can't remember the last time like that I've just gone on a streak of birdies in a row. I made a few eagles here and there, and then, like, a couple birdies in a row. But, like, I can't remember the last time I just had, like, five straight birdies or something like that, you know? It's been too long, so let's do that. Why? I keep hitting everything fast all of a sudden. Like, it's all of a sudden that that's happening, too. Bounce backwards, please. No, man. I can't be doing this shit. Yeah, he's probably not too pleased about like, that. Like, you can't be doing that off the tee. You you can't score in this game if you're not hitting the fairways. Because the rough is... It's so hard to hit it out of the rough. And it's the nearly impossible to hit it out of the rough. And, and I'm hitting everything fast at the moment. It's ridiculous. This one's a toss-up. Let's see where this Shut one up. will land. Shut up, John. Back into the rough again. Surprise, surprise. Well, it's tough the rough king is back. Uh, still in the rough. And though. we're not going on a birdie streak here anyway, unless we flop this one into the hole. Quite unfortunate. Just realized the lie, actually, so... Put a bit of D-loft rather than loft. And that's still a tester for a... But if I bogey this, yeah, I'm going to be so upset with myself. Legit. Oh, God. And Thank God for that. Dropped. I really thought we were about to miss that. Like, yeah, I would have probably freaked out. <laughs> I would have freaked out. All right, we're two under. Come on. Okay, now moving Don't on be to stupid, stupid. All right, this is a reachable par four, is it? Or par f no, it's not. It's not reachable at all. Maybe it is, with the wind, and the downhill nature of this shot. I'm just gonna go for it, fuck it. I'm gonna actually aim a little bit further right and try and hit this a tiny bit fast. And we did hit it a tiny bit fast. That is an absolute beauty! What a shot! Oh dear lord, I didn't need to hit it fast, did I? I didn't even need to hit it fast. That's perfect. That might be in the hole! That might be in the hole! That might be in the hole! Oh! 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 Ladies and gentlemen, we have witnessed history. There's no that way! Was a hole in one. That just and happened! After that one, currently sitting at five under for the day. Oh for my goodness. Can you believe it, baby? Let's go. Let's go from two under to five under with one hole. Holy shit, that was literally perfect. 
I said I was trying to hit it a little bit fast, and I did hit it a little bit fast. I wish I would have seen a replay of that. At least I have it on video. No one can deny it. I have it right here. Video proof, baby. Let's go. Now let's let's move on from that, dude. Let's start making some moves, baby. That was sensational stuff. Holy God, I can't believe that just happened. That was a 350-yard par 4. We just had a... An, a double eagle on a hole in one on a par four. What just happened? Oh my god, I can't believe it. That is just beautiful. Imagine we went back to back hole in ones. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Oh my god. I really thought for one, for a split second that yeah, that might have bounced in. More birdie. But we'll take the birdie. We'll take the birdie all day long, baby. Finishing oh my hole god. Hole in one birdie. We're four under for the last yeah, two holes. Six under for the day. And that also means he is tied. Holy shit, I can't place. believe that, man. I can't believe that. <laughs> now, the 13th hole. Oh, let's go. Let's freaking go. That was epic, man. That was truly epic. I still can't believe that. That was beautiful. Beautiful sight. Oh, no. Well, oh, thank so God. So it's avoiding the trees. One. That's actually perfect now. It's perfect now, Johnny. Ideal, to be honest. Now, can we go on a birdie From streak now after yards. a hole in one and a par four? You know. You know. All right, I'm actually going to hit the nine iron. Put a little bit of loft. The wind is quite strong into us there, it looks like. So put a little bit of loft on this bad boy. It's going to come back off the left side and... If it is long, then that's fine because it's going to come back off the end of the green anyway. I hit it fast. Really? Did I hit it fast, though? Looks like I did. I don't this think it's long anyway. Long, folks. It's perfect. Oh, it is a bit long. It's not very long, though. It's kind of good, actually. Pretty good. I think that'll play uh, safely on the If it was perfect, perfect, it would have been right on it, probably, because fast makes it go left as well, you know? Stay up. Stay up. Stay up. No, I just needed a little bit more. I just needed to hit that a small bit harder. Birdie, unfortunately. That's what she said. Oh, and damn it. Tap, they'll get a par. All right, we'll take it. And uh, there's six under on the day after that hole. Six under through 13. Seventh place on the leaderboard. Okay. Seventh place on the leaderboard. Let's get inside that top five. If we get inside that top five by the end of this round, I'll be happy. Five holes remaining. And setting up now on the 14th hole. Get to that kind of eight under, nine under mark, you know? It's possible. Yo, is this right drivable? Is this out of bounds down here? Doesn't matter anyway, because it's 100% not drivable, but... I thought with the downhill nature, but it's 360. That's not even close to drivable. We'll take a nice good, little drive so down the right side of the fairway and put this one close, hopefully. This is like a completely average round without that hole in one, but the hole in one just makes it a great round now. <laughs> And a video well worth watching. Let's freaking go, dude. Let's go. Hole in one, baby. Can you really believe it, eh? No, I'm not going to hit that. I'm going to put some D-loft on this instead. Going with the pitching wedge here. Be the right distance. Be the right distance today. Oh, it's a little short, okay. Maybe I should have gone with the 148. Didn't quite know how strong that wind was, but I did put a fair bit of D-loft on it. So it seems like maybe the 9-iron would have been the right choice. I'm not hitting these putts hard enough, man. Like, they're bang on line. I'm actually hitting the putts really well today. They're bang on line. I'm just kind of not giving them enough juice. And that's going to be back-to-back pars after... The hole in one and the birdie. And the oh my nice god, I barely putt. made that. Alright, now let's finish with a couple of birdies. Come on. Let's finish strong. I want to finish strong. Tied for seventh on the I want board. to finish strong, mates. We need to get to nine under and to be in the top five. The 15th, so three birdies 10th. out of the last four. Come on, that's possible. Hopefully there's a par five in here somewhere. This is a decent length par four. Solid par four here. Downhill though, so... Should be down the middle, yeah, and it is. For the it's a here. cool course, though. I like it. It's a nice course. And I especially like that hole that we got a hole-in-one on. 
My favorite hole on that. That's my favorite hole so far, 100%. yards to the pin. <laughs> Alright. This is going to be a little long, so should I hit the 136 outright? Uh, I don't know if that's going to be enough. Probably will be. Put a little bit of D-loft on this. It should be enough. Oh, I pushed it a little. Get up and get that hill! Get up! Yes! Go on! Keep going! That hill there! Is, is that... No! It kind of got stuck on it. Yeah, I'm semi-pleased with that, I would say, because I would I would expect it a little bit better there. Alright, it actually doesn't break that much. It breaks kind of at the start, and then breaks at the end again, but it's minimal. I think maybe here might be decent. Oh, that one I smashed. Actually, well, Ooh, like, the I greens are pretty slow, to be fair, in. but there just wasn't that much break, this and I did push it a little bit. And it's another par, three pars in a row. Come on, we need we need three birdies to finish. Three birdies in a row to finish. And let's let's do it. Steady at seventh place That's what I asked for. We, we at least need to go against the South African fella ahead of them. Jordan the golfer, come on. Come on, Jordan. And you know you can't match up, up against me. Oh, God, this is index team. one. It's actually been a lot harder these last few holes. It's been solid par fours with decent length. Like, there's been no gimmies really at all. It's been all tough holes. That's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Come on, let's birdie index one. 500 yard par four. Uphill. Let's show them what we're made of. Why not, you know? And this next shot setting up significantly below the hole. Hmm. Do I want to go up a club here? I feel like I nearly need to. Put a tiny bit of loft on. No, I hit that it fast. Like if a, I, uh, five I could have hit the 183 if I was going to hit it fast, man. No, get that back down this hill. Back down this hill. No, like you idiot. If I had just hit the 183 there and hit it and fast, it would have been perfect. The green with quite I couldn't a bit hit it fast. If, oh, feck's sake, that man. That is annoying. That is annoying. That's in. Ooh, that, that There's no way. Weird. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate, man. And we never kicked on after okay, the par four and the and the birdie. Board. The par four hole in one and the birdie after it. We and never kicked on. Right in seventh, All par since. One. It's depressing. That seems to happen a lot in golf, though. Something crazy will happen, like you get a hole in one, or, you know, and then you just, everything slows down. I don't know, you feel like you're at the summit, you can't do much more. This is a par 5, though. Very reachable, so this is, should be at least a birdie. Come on. Has to be at least a birdie. Has to be at least a birdie. 100%. Oh, no. I pushed it. It's fine, though. It's it's absolutely like it's perfect. Into the fairway. It's going to kick down as well. Off the ridge. Boom. That's going to be a 350. Nah, 330. A little bit over it. Can we reach the green in two? It looks like it's right over a bunker, so it might be hard to get close, but we'll see. 30 to the pin. Yeah, it is. And this club is going to be too much. This club is going to be too much, but the one above it's going to be too little, so it's pretty much we're in no man's land here. There's not a lot we can do to get this close. Oh, I fucking sliced it. We sliced the shit out of it. All right, let's just get up and down for a birdie. I'll be happy with it. If it was on the green, it would have gone way too far anyway, so it would have gone over the back and probably been the same, and I don't think same that distance, the same chip. Shot. Bit too much club on that. Bit too much club, mate. You're right there. No, I hit slow. Damn it. All right, uphill putt for the birdie, though. Has to bird. make this. If I miss this, I'm going to freak out. I missed it. Oh, yeah, thank God it caught the left side there. I was going to be upset yeah, with myself. Seven under par Finally got day. to seven under. And he is also in a tie for sixth place. Tied for six. Darren's going to beat me. Damn it. Darren and plays this game all the time. Hole, all right. That's my excuse. Unless we get a hole in one, we'll tie his, we'll tie his score if we get a hole in one on this par five. 575 yards. It's doable. For sure. It's absolutely not doable. I'm going for this green instead. You know, it would be doable if this was the green, but... Unfortunately, it's it's absolutely not. Oh, what the hell's going on there? Oh, no, I hit it slow. 
Yikes, that's going to be right in the middle of this rough. There's no need for that, man. Kick. Yes, thank you. All right. I don't know why I hit it so slow. It's okay, though. Still went 335 yards. 333 yards. And, uh, I think so he's it's not like the that. end of the world. For sure. And it's reachable. Uh, the problem is, is this, this is going to be too far. And this is going to be too slow. Like, there's no way... I don't have a club for this, man. I hate when that happens. I'm going to go with this one, though, because I feel like this might just be able to reach if we hit it fast. I hit it very fast. We didn't want to hit it very fast. Because very fast doesn't make it go as far. Like, f you want that fast, but not very fast. We've hit it into this bunker. We need to get up and down to finish 8 under. Come on. Let's, let's at least get up and down for the 8 under. At the very least, mate. It's the least we could do. Ideal. It's going to come back down off that, surely. It stayed there. Oh, no, it didn't. Thankfully. It pretty wow, much stayed nice. up there. I thought and it was going to come back down a lot further than that. A whole lot easier. Still not very easy, though. Next putt is for a final round score of 65. Ooh, thank 30. God for that. <laughs> a 65. Pretty happy with that. Eight under, though. This is a par 73. Yeah, I guess there is a lot of par fives. A lot of par fives, indeed. Eight under. Happy with myself. The, par, the, the hole in one on the par four, obviously, is the highlight of the day. And we finish in sixth. Well, obviously, there's going to be a lot more people playing this event. I can see someone going pretty low on this course, though. I think maybe 13 under will be catched and someone will shoot 16, 17 under. Quite happy with my round, though. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed watching it. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that hole in one. Uh, drop a like on the video. It's the best way to let me know that you do, you do enjoy these videos weekly. And I will continue to bring them uh, as long as they're supported. So, thank you all for watching. We'll see you next week for another Fantasy Course of the Week. If there's anything else you want to see on the channel, just let me know down in the comments. Sound off, you know. I love having a conversation. I'll always reply to comments. Um, I'll see you guys... Yeah, I'll see you guys next week or else for my other videos, my tennis videos, my Witcher videos, whatever you want. Go check them out and I'll see you guys soon. Peace out. It's been my pleasure to serve you. All right, so I just wanted to take a minute at the end of each video to thank my beautiful members. Thank you all for supporting me. It really does mean a lot. So coming in at the wolf level, which is the top level, the 999 tier, is Yuji Outlaw, Sylvan Jamies, Anthony Roberts, and Casey Wood. You are all rock stars. And coming in at the hound level, Game Riot, Tiago, Daxman, Pico, Leanne, Brent Clapper, Rocky, uh, Maximus, Hay, and Pani Ka. I don't know if I'm saying that right. I apologize. But and then that that's the 499 level. Coming in at the puppy level, which is the 199 level, we got Rob, and we got Robot Challenges, we got Chris Eric, we got Jan ba or John, sorry, John Barron, Doc D, and Jack MDG, my boy Jack. So thank you all for the massive support. It really does mean a lot. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the content. Peace out. It's been my pleasure to serve you.